how you're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon. If you don't stick around to see my first item, you're gonna be like missing the craziest thing. Two of us just tested it. We're like, no way, it really works. Like, it's unbelievable. But I'll get to that in just a second. What are we doing tonight? Well, we've got a great hour just kind of getting you prepared for, I don't know, basically, I guess the fall. And also in case of some emergencies as well. Um, this I had for dinner tonight. And I was really pleased, by the way. I made it for my husband too. And we tried it. We did a uh, chicken flavored kind of like a pot pie experience, right? And so my husband, I was at home and he said, what is this? And I go, oh, it's ready wise. I'm going to have it on the air tonight. And he, and he says, well, can I eat some? I go, yeah, that's why I made it for us. And do you know what he said? He's so funny. He was in the army for years. He goes, oh my God, it's so much better than MRIs. And he said, wow, if you're in an emergency, this really, and he was like selling it to me. It was pretty funny. He said, wow, if you're in an emergency, this really does taste really good. And I go, yeah, I know. Right. Isn't that cool? Anyway, guys, we have a great pack. This is actually 60 servings. It's from Ready Wise. It's ready to go. It has a huge shelf life. And daggone it, it tastes good. We even went through the ingredients to see what they used in it because it really was almost unbelievable. But you should be ready, whether it's an emergency because you don't have a paycheck coming in and you've got at least food to eat, or it's a true emergency like a hurricane or a winter storm and you just don't have access to food. This is a way to have it ready when you need it in case of that emergency. It's a fabulous, fabulous offer from one of the names that comes to having prepared food. Uh, but first, I got to show you this, and I've got like two minutes to do everything, so we were cracking up. So I'm taking this basil. I'm going to rub it my hands really, really hard. Like, look, guys, I'm going to show you. Rub your rub. Do I have to do the deal thing? All right, do the deal thing. Steal this deal. I have 200 and you better get it because this is crazy. All right, so I have basil. I just rubbed it in my hands. And there's a ton of it on my hands. Look at that. Ugh. Okay, love basil, but it smells. Now, you literally take, this is a full copper bar. It's like a stone, really. And you rub it. Now, this has, which I find amazing, it's naturally self-sanitizing for odors and it also naturally is antimicrobial, which is crazy. So you rub it in your hands and then guess what? Your hands don't smell. I mean, no basil. Now, I even did it tougher. I said, go get me a knife. They threw these onions out here. I'm like, fine, let's try this. Grab the onion. This is onion, guys. Like really stinky, you know, burning your eyes. You want to cry onion, right? Okay, horrible. I know you can't smell it, but you just saw me touch the onion. This is the craziest thing. You literally rub this in your hands just for a couple seconds. It's not soap. It's literally 100%, it's all copper. You do this, and then all of a sudden you go, okay. Onion smell is gone, like completely gone. Now you get the little bag to go with it and you also get this little polishing cloth. All you do is polish it up every now and then. Now, why do you want this? Number one, cooking at home, right? Hands stink, they won't after this. This is a great one for me though. You can leave this in your car. How often do you go and you touch the gas, you know, go to, let's say you go to a gas station, you pump the gas, you go inside, you want to get a sandwich, and then you come back and your hands have just been on the gas pump and they smell of gas and of course all the germs on it, and then you're going to eat the sandwich. No, you pull this out, you literally, remember it's antimicrobial, you rub it in your hands, and not only is it going to help with sanitizing your hands, but it's going to get rid of the gas smell. That onion smell is gone. You have to try it to believe it. Also, a lot of guys who go fishing and then they clean their fish, they love this because again, or even if you're out on the boat, let's say, and you catch a fish or by the lake, you literally, you know, unhook the fish, your hands stink, you just rub it. There's no liquid, it's not soap or anything like that, and all of a sudden, the smell is completely gone. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm blown away. All right, it's Steal the Deal, which means we've got the lowest price we've ever done, and I've got about 150 left. Definitely try that. I mean, so many people love that, and I can totally see why now. First time I ever tried it, and I'm shocked. All right, come on over here. We're going to show you a little bit of origami. I know uh, Shannon last hour had some origami in her show, and I was really excited to have this little guy on tonight because it's truly one of my favorites. I have a great big guy that started it all. I got a couple of those, and then I bought a version of this that's much smaller. And actually in mine, because it has wheels, I have it pushed in my closet this way. So when I walk to the front of my closet and I open the doors, I roll mine out like this, I get what I want, and then I push it back in. And so I store my items like this, almost like filing cabinets. And I absolutely love it. What has it done? I can store a whole bunch on this in a whole little bit of space. So if you're trying to get organized, if it's a bathroom, if it's an attic that's a mess, a basement, 
the garage with all those awful, awful um, paint cans on that horrible particle board shelving unit, this is what you want. Now, here's what we're doing for just this hour alone. You have free shipping and it ends in 60 minutes. I have three colors available. We've got the white, which is always hugely popular. Then I have the black and we have the red. And Miss Tracy Rose is gonna join us because daggone it, don't you spend your hard-earned money on anything, any other shelf, unless it has the name origami on it. And why is that, Miss Tracy Rosa? <laughs> Um, quality, convenience, not having to spend an entire afternoon or day putting something together, or in my case, fighting with my husband to try and make him put it together. That's why people love it so much. So what do we mean by quality and convenience? Remember, this is powder coated steel, so it's not gonna rust. It won't chip or corrode. Convenience is this. That's your assembly. You basically unfold it. Okay, here's that famous origami toggle in the back. You flip that through, push that down. Now the entire shelving system is um, secure. Flip that top shelf over, and now you're good to go. You decide whether or not you want the wheels on. If you want the wheels on, it's literally like screwing in a light bulb, super easy. This one also gives you the ability to customize your pantry rack the way that you want to. So before we just offer the pantry rack like this, right, Suzanne? Mm -hmm. Now we've added those drawers, which I think is fantastic. You've got that wonderful mesh, so you can see everything that is inside of there, never a question. So you can put your fresh fruits and vegetables in here. You can put paper products in here. You can put your paper towels, your toilet paper, all of that. But look at this. Look at how they slide perfectly into the bottom two shelves. Like I said, you can use it with or without the drawers, all right? And if you're not using it with the drawers, look at this, Suzanne, how they break down to practically nothing. The way that you assemble these is you unfold it like so, okay? Go ahead and unfold it, and then you pop that bottom um, shelf or the bottom flip right in there. There you go, just like that and now you've got a drawer. So you can basically use this as a drawer system or you can use this as a shelving system completely up to you. Let's talk about dimensions when it comes to this unit because it's kind of like, yeah. Right, hold on one yeah, second, there we go. Okay, I just want you guys, <laughs> can you hear me? Um, I want you to see, look at this. So there's the drawer she's talking about. It actually comes with a stopper too, which is great. You can see I've got the bottom drawer down here. Um, just wanna let you know, if you want the white, if you want the white, I have 450 left and this is sold out. Please remember, free shipping is a huge deal. These aren't the size of a teeny little earring box. These are big boxes. It literally comes basically assembled. You literally just drop it open and hook that thing on and put these together and you're good, right? So you're not going to have that plastic box of pieces. You're not going to have that bad particle board that just starts to bow and falls apart. It's really an investment that you make that you'll have from this moment on. It's like it's like a really good marriage. It's going to last for a really long time. And it's funny, uh, my son Trace and his girlfriend are actually moving in together this Sunday or this Saturday. And I'm, mm -hmm. I mean, I'm happy for him, but, and my son gets a closet and all it has is a couple really bad wire shelves in it. <laughs> and they, so they FaceTime me to show me his closet. And I t said to Macy, which is his girlfriend, I said, Mace, I said, please go in and then go on hsn.com. Please look at all of our origami. I go, that is not good space usage in his closet. It's just one little wire <laughs> shelf. It's awful. So I told her, let me know, and then we'll go through and help pick out some pieces for you. Why did I recommend origami? Because they're going to use it in their first little apartment together, but also it's going to be their first house and maybe, you know, down the road when they downsize. Uh, once you invest in an origami piece, guys, I always say you buy it for a specific reason like, yes, pantry. Oh, great for my guest bathroom or great for the bathroom, whatever. But what it ends up happening is it morphs with you as your life circumstance changes. And this is one of the best size to get because it's small, it's convenient, and yet it packs a ton. In fact, there are three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 cans here on the top of just vegetables. So it's not like it only holds a couple little insects significant things, you can really pack this baby out when you get that great stability and the strength and the quality of origami. So I just wanted to show you how good that was. Sorry, Trace, didn't mean to totally yeah. interrupt, but I had to share my funny story. No. Because you no, know, as host, so I really recommend, I recommend the stuff that I really love and I wouldn't right. recommend it if I didn't already own it and also know it's going to be good for my son and his girlfriend. 
Well, I'm so glad you told that story because I have a very similar one. My best friend's son, kind of like my nephew, is going away to college next week on the 16th. Mm -hmm. And literally, we did the same exact thing, Suzanne. We sat down on hsn.com. I was like, you need this origami for a dorm room. You need this origami for the, you know, different areas. She picked up this one because it has the drawers, okay? Because when she and I went to college together, you're right. We used particle board. We used plastic. We crates. used junk. And you know we had to throw it out. Did you yeah, use right? any of the stolen milk crates? <laughs> Absolutely. And then we put like a nice little um, fabric thing over top to make it fancy. You know, yes. we were classy back in those days, Suzanne. <laughs> but here's the thing. We tossed that stuff out at when we were done with yeah. our freshman year, when we were done with our sophomore year, because you don't pack particle board up. Right. You know, and granted, not all people are buying this for dorm rooms, but think about if you move, if you rent, if you want to go from room to room or home to home, you know, you want something that's substantial. So the thing that I love about this unit, Suzanne, is it is kind of like our Goldilocks of a size. So let's talk about the dimensions, okay? You've got a length of 17 inches across, okay? 11 inches deep, so it's less than a foot off of the wall. So it's not too big, it's not too bulky. It stands about 58 inches tall. So you've got to really use that vertical storage space that we all have in our home. So you can use it just like this, right? Without the drawers if you want. Each shelf is gonna hold 20 pounds worth of weight. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100 pounds worth of weight. If you wanna put the drawers in, which again, I love this. The reason why she picked this up is because this will be a place where you can put all of his socks, his underwear, all of that stuff that just gets thrown everywhere. And then he can stack all of his clothes. But look at, if you want to slide those drawers in, now each one of those drawers will hold 10 pounds worth of weight. So this is really a sturdy, sturdy unit. I like the mobility of it. Cause like you said earlier, you can stack one right in front of the other. So you can move this one out of the way if you need the toaster or move this one out of the way if you need to get your, you know, your your bleach or your laundry detergent out. It is such a great unit. And I will say this with true honesty, too much information, Tracy. If you see free shipping on origami, call your mom, call your best friend, yep. call your neighbor, call whatever, because it does not happen. It's powder it's coated exactly steel. Right. Each one of these shelves is 20 pounds. So again, that's a huge deal right there. Yeah, no, we don't do free shipping. In fact, we had them the other day on free shipping. And so when I walked in tonight, I was pleasantly surprised. I'm like, oh good, mine's on free shipping tonight still, right? But unfortunately that does end at midnight tonight. And again, this isn't inexpensive to send to you because it comes in a really big box. It's beautifully packaged, by the way. It's really, the, the hard hardest part of the whole thing is honestly getting it out of the packaging. Putting it together is nothing. I mean, it's absolutely nothing to put it together. But what's nice about this is with that free shipping, it is a substantial savings. And even without free shipping, because we haven't decided what my son needs for his closet, I'm okay with it. And it's because if I invest in it, then I know they're going to be able to use it for literally years to come. I can, you know, storage is so important. And shelving, we all need tons of shelving. Please don't buy the plastic. Don't buy those little plastic drawer things. Don't buy the particle board or the little bad kind of fake wood stuff. It just doesn't have the longevity that origami has. So even when I pick out my pieces for those guys and they tell me what they want, I'm honestly going to be okay with paying the shipping simply because I know it's great investment. And also do me a favor, go to hsn.com. You're going to be shocked at how many perfect five-star review origami has. You'll see it over and over and over and over again. Just tons of customer picks because the quality is there. And other people agree with me. They're like, okay, yeah, it's not a $25 shelf, a plastic cheap shelf, but you know what? It's absolutely worth the investment. All right, guys, the white is almost gone. Oh, thanks, Kevin. We're to show you. Look at that. Customer pick, customer pick, customer pick, customer pick, customer pick. I mean, it's, I, and you know what's funny? I didn't even go online to see how many customer picks there were. I just know it's success and how many millions of origami shelves we've sold here at HSN. So I was confident that if you went on without even me checking, you were going to see that so many of these are an absolute favorite. The white is almost gone, guys. This is always the most popular, and I think the reason why is kitchen friendly, bathroom friendly, guest room friendly, basically any room friendly. It's perfect for that. Oh, funny story too, Trace. When I was talking to I was talking to Ethan and Macy together, and Ethan goes, Oh yeah, Macy, you want the origami. It's really good stuff. Because he's seen the origami in our house. And he's like, Yeah, we need to get the origami. He goes, We're gonna really you're gonna because we can even put it in the living room. He was helping her decorate, which I thought was very funny. Anyway, black uh, is the second I, most I'm popular. Gonna, oh, sorry. Go ahead, honey. 
I was going to say, I, I, you know, he's probably seen how easy it is, too. Yes. So he's probably like, Macy, you got to get this because he knows he's not going to have to spend an afternoon putting this together. You know, <laughs> it's going to he's like, yeah, I get it. It's going to be easy for the best of us. It's going to save. I, I said, I don't think this is a legally uh, approved claim, Suzanne, but I'm like, origami saving relationships across the country. Right. Because, <laughs> yes. Like, <laughs> it's a marriage saver. <laughs> right. <laughs> don't quote me on that. I can't prove that it'll save marriages, but. If you know, you know. <laughs> right, right. Hey, guys, okay, so white's almost gone. Black's awesome, and this is how I do the, my analogy between white and black. Have you ever gone past a, f a house, and they have a white fence, and you go, oh, what a pretty white fence. Or you go, back, go past another house, and they have a black fence, and you go, oh, how elegant. I didn't even really see the black fence. So that's how I think about black and white. Red's always fun. That's just a really fun pop of color. If you've got red appliances, like a KitchenAid, and you've all, you love, you've got red pots and pans, you're going to love that. One more thing, Trace, you didn't mention that I have to show everybody is, and we'll have to use the overhead camera for it. If you are a crafter like I am, Ooh. this will hold your 12 by 12 paper um, or files, like almost a filing cabinet upright. So now you open it up, you can go through all your 12 by 12 paper and organize it via print, color, holidays, whatever you want to do. This will easily hold those 12 by 12 sheets and you've got two of the shelves. Now again, you can take these out and just use it as pure shelves, but I love Love this addition. Also great if you go to bulk stores and you buy a whole bunch of potatoes and you want to aerate them. Works great for that. I mean, the list just goes on and on. Hey, one thing too I want to show you guys, and I thought Lou showed this the other day, Trace. I thought it was really smart. A lot of times with shelf, if I were to push this can off a normal shelf, what would happen? Right. It's going to roll off the front of it. Because you've got that lip on it, it doesn't roll off. So I love that, Trace, because they've made it even more secure for all the stuff we pile on our shelves. It's the little things, Suzanne. I always say, you know, the engineers at Origami, how many times have they dropped a can on their toe to know that we need that little lip right there? You know, we've all done it, especially when you have something so mobile. You don't want to have something that, you know, again, it's easy to move around, but then it ha it's easy for things to fall off of as well. Right. Also, the other thing with this is it is that powder coated steel, and I hate to keep harping on this, but it's a big feature because that means it's indoor and outdoor use. So if you have a lanai, if you have a pool area, if you have a patio, um, if you have a balcony or something like that, this is great for that area. You can store your citronella candles in there. You can go ahead and put some beautiful pots on there. You can put make it into a beautiful herb garden, whatever you want with this one. And it's great for all of those small nooks and crannies. In your house. Yeah, the size is impeccable. This is such a good, good yeah. size for this too. All right, we're gonna wrap it up. Trace, thanks for being a part of our show tonight. Suzanne, have a great day. You too. All right, White's almost gone, guys. Please remember the free shipping ends in 45 minutes. Oh, my copper bar. You guys have got that. I'm so happy you got that. That's the most unbelievable thing. I have never seen that in my entire life until tonight, and I can't believe how great that works. Yeah, it's sold out. Okay. Also, let me tell you what's happening with our today's special. Okay, if you guys didn't see it, this really relates very well to our show tonight. I'm going to run over here and show it to you guys live, actually. Um, this is awesome, and it's kind of a little bit near and dear to my heart because my husband and I, uh, most recently, my, my husband worked full-time and he's computer software analysis and, um, uh, or analyst, and he worked completely off-grid. And how did we do it? We used the EcoFlow, which is a solar paneled system, but then we have two gas generators. And between the three of those, he was able to work more than eight hours a day every single day of the week at his full-time job, and we were completely off-grid, which is pretty remarkable. Uh, the reason we have the generators and even the EcoFlow, though, originally was because of emergencies. Today, we've got a really unique system, and this works two ways. It works with regular gas or works with propane. When I saw the presentation with Shannon a little earlier, what shocked me is how quiet it is. And on top of that, you could use either gas or propane and with only a 25% load, I think it's 20 hours on propane and it's almost eight hours. I think it was eight hours, guys. Do you have that graphic? I'm not sure, but I think it's eight hours with gas on a 25% load. Oh, thanks guys. So here's some details. Uh, you can see, look at power is a full size fridge, an air conditioning unit, yeah, a microwave, waves, a television, nine hours of runtime on the 25% load. You can see it there on the propane, six hours on all the big appliances, 14 hours. Look at that on your iPads and all that. And even the fridge and nine hours on a 50% load. It's really unique. These are one of the biggest companies in the world. They are the number one in Canada and the U S you've got all the inputs that you need. And please remember the price is going to end here at midnight and it doesn't end just, you know, 10 bucks. It doesn't go up 10 bucks. It's going to go up to 
Oh, it goes up $200 in 45 minutes. So be ready, be prepared. I think this is a brilliant unit to be able to do that. And look at all that. I mean, it's really advanced, but boy, when you're in emergency, the, there's two things in emergency you don't want to worry about. Number one is power and number two is food. There's your power. I got food coming up. Hey, let me tell you what's coming up at midnight tonight. Oh, stick with me. Oh my gosh, I always say this. How's your mattress? Like, how's it doing? Is it kind of old and gross? It's got stains on it? Or, and maybe you're just thinking, honey, we just need to buy a new mattress. This one's bit the dust. Do not do it yet. Do not spend hundreds, potentially thousands of dollars before you see midnight. We have our last and final mattress topper today's special from Concierge Collection coming up. It's got a beautiful above standard loft and it's got an amazing, amazing amount of what's called Cool Max technology, which we all love. You'll see that at midnight. I've got Wise Food coming up next. best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks like VIP financing on so many items, plus extra flex on every item under $399 all day, every day, and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Includes fraud protection and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash HSN card. You guys, please don't forget about the um, gas generator um, because that and this next item together, I think really gives you true peace of mind. And there's nothing worse than in a big emergency, running out of power, i.e. we've covered that, or certainly running out of food, uh, or not having food, or not being able to make food easily. Well, we love ReadyWise here at HSN because they allow you to have really good great tasting food and all you need is some water to make it happen and tonight we have an exclusive kit that actually is 60 servings of some of the best ready to go food that you ever find i really love the grab bag it comes with i think that's super convenient so you can literally grab it and you can go and it might be an emergency like oh my gosh i lost my job and i need some food to eat or it could be a true emergency like a hurricane or ice where you simply can't get to the store or the power's been out for so long there's nothing in the fridge left Left, you always can now know for the next 25 years that you've got really good food ready to go. Now, I want to show you a picture because I made my husband dinner tonight. Easiest dinner I've ever made in my life. <laughs> now, you don't have to boil the water, but it recommends for each of these to do four cups of water. And I boiled it, and then you throw it in, and we were done. So my husband comes up to me, he says, what are you having for dinner? And I said, we're going to have this. He goes, well, what is it? I go, well, believe it or not, it's ready to eat food. So he took one bite, and he goes, oh, my God, it's so much better than MRIs. He was in the Army forever. That was his first statement, MRIs. Yeah, ready to eat meals, right? M ready to, what is it? Wait, MREs. Oh, meals ready to eat, yes. So that was his first thing. And then the second thing he started eating, he goes, oh my gosh. He goes, it's surprisingly really good. He goes, boy, if you're in an emergency, this, this, this will do it, it'll make you happy. So it was so funny that he had never tried it before. And we both ate it tonight. That was a picture of the little bowl I was eating. And it makes a lot, we have a lot to get into. And I've got Stephanie here to kind of get into it with me. I Hello. That you did that. Isn't that. That was dinner tonight. That's exactly <laughs> what actually we'd like everybody to do, right? Because we want to know that it's tastes good. So how do you know? You try, try it. it. You get it home, you make one. Uh, Shannon Fox was saying that she kind of did the same thing with her kids, but she didn't even tell them what it was. She's just like, oh, I just made a different kind of mac and cheese tonight. Do you like it? And they were like, yeah, this is better than usual. <laughs> oh, so, really? Exactly. That's it's awesome. better than her cooking. So <laughs> the food is there and it tastes great. So what ReadyWise is all about is it's keeping you ready for anything that comes your way. And boy, if there's anything we've learned over the past couple of years, it can happen. If it can, it probably will right? So being prepared for any of it is so important. And no matter what is going on in the world, we have to eat. So what ReadyWise has done is they have taken some awesome recipes, whether it's the chicken pot pie that you tried so tonight, had. the cheesy mac, and that's the one that we've got here is that chicken pot pie. They've taken the recipes, chefs wrote the recipes. There are real ingredients, real foods that are then both a combination of dehydrated and freeze-dried. And the reason is different foods 
do better having different processes done to them. Meaning what she, uh, what Suzanne was able to eat with her husband, it wasn't mushy, it wasn't like no, pasty. And the all. reason is the potatoes were treated the way potatoes want to be treated so that you get the great textures, you get the awesome flavors, you get the spices. The chefs figured out the recipes and the scientists figure out how to treat the food. And here's the really cool pouch. How to make which is essentially a smart pouch right. to hold it in. Because it's one thing to have great tasting food. I mean, I'm a pretty good cook, but I have no idea how to keep things in a pouch for up to 25 years. That's where the Ready Wise Science has come in. So that every one of these recipes that we talk about and we'll make and we'll sample and we'll tell you what makes them great, every one of the things you're gonna see is ready for you whenever you need them. All you have to do is keep it in a cool, dry place for up to 25 years. So this isn't something like the emergency kit you may have right now with cans, with pouches mm -hmm. of you know things from the grocery stores. You have to replace those every Every year. There's nothing I hate more than throwing out food. But if I pack an emergency kit and then I go back and I check the expiration dates, which everything that comes from the grocery store has, you're going to be getting rid of that food. Right. Absolutely. You should. Ab I mean, you need to. We have a lot of people who are preppers. You know, they prep mm -hmm. for hurricanes, especially here in Florida. I mean, because we're, we're always in hurricane season. You know, oh, it's hurricane <laughs> season again. So uh, the, most everybody I know, we all have our own little way to prep. And a lot of people go and they replace it or they don't replace it. And God knows if they have to use it they can't it's eat icky. it like big things of rice where it's got little rice bugs in there right with this you never have to worry about it and i'll tell you what i loved quite frankly is being able to pick it up and go yes like it's just if you've got to get in the car and you've got to get out of there there's nothing worse than being in an emergency and in some circumstances i.e hurricanes you get the warning so you got to get in the car and go well you can't pack your whole fridge inside there so literally you grab this and out the door you go if you're a camper maybe you love going camping or hiking oh my goodness this is the best way to Absolutely. do it. Absolutely. And it was funny, my, my husband was reason, reading the amount of calories and carbs, right? Mm -hmm. And the calories are really reasonable, which was nice to see, right? Yeah. And he said, oh, it's higher in carbs. But then he thought about it, and he said, well, of course, in an emergency or if you're hiking, you want to have more carbs. You need those carbs for energy. Absolutely. So I thought, wow, isn't that funny how my husband really logically kind of went through all the reasons why this is such a good product. And these meals are very specifically chosen, first of all, because they taste great, but also because they're put together so that you can make a day's worth of meals with 40 grams of protein. And yes. protein is it's important protein. because, yes, that is a lot and a good healthy amount of protein. Protein keeps you full, right? So whether you're in an emergency or just going through your basic day, if you're trying to eat things that are efficient for your body, you need a blend of carbohydrates mm -hmm. and protein. And again, that's where the science comes in. That's how these meals are put together. So let me show you how it works because let me, let me give you a little secret. Suzanne, she didn't work very hard to cook a dinner today for her husband. No, I did not. This is all she has to do. All you do is add water. Now, I know Suzanne told you she boiled her water. You can see that we've got pots here. Everything tastes better when it's warm, right? I mean, right. just no surprise about that. So right now, I'm going to add this to warm water. But you don't have to boil the water. No. If we were in a true emergency right now, and we didn't have our great generator from the Today Special, and we were using tap water, we were using freezing cold water in the winter, this would still reconstitute. So you don't have to have warm water. If you can, of course, you'll probably enjoy the, just the sensation of warm food more. But in terms of texture, in terms of flavor, that chicken pot pie that you ate for dinner and that wonderful little snap those potatoes had, yeah. which I really love. You know what's funny? I can taste the celery. Oh, fun. Yeah, like, it was fun. It was interesting to be able to taste the distinct flavors of the vegetables. Peppers and peas and like, carrots. It was very surprising. They're all in there. Because I think a lot of us, when we think about ready-to-eat meals, right, we're thinking, oh, it's just kind of like porridge. Right. You know, or like Ugh. oatmeal, you know? It's like, oh, it just has this one bland texture. taste. Texture, yeah. Yeah, and texture, yeah, really a bad texture, right? It's the right? swishy texture think that porridge. goes in. Yeah. Right, and I'm so, glad you tried this one, because did you notice the potatoes yes. actually had a little crunch and pop to them? Yes, you know, it wasn't just like mush. You're like, so what's kind of <laughs> cool to me is even if you do this with tap water, cold water, as long as it's safe drinking water, you can have a great tasting meal. The texture will still be there. The flavors will still be there. The spices will still be there. The only thing different is the temperature. So of course, if you're not in an emergency or you have the ability to make warm food with warm water, do it. If not, there is dinner regardless. Isn't that fun? All right, guys, so you're getting 60 servings. Now, yep. here's what also surprised me. Where is it? Is this bag full? Uh, yeah. Okay, I was surprised how big the bags are. 
are. Like they're really, really big. In oh, fact, absolutely. there was enough for probably four of us to eat when we there finished the, been. Ch the chicken pot there pie. There should have been. Okay, so yeah. this is the one you made. Yeah. I can divide this into quarters because each and it's, pouch. And it's hearty. Yes, each pouch is four servings. So for instance, for the chicken pot pie, you're getting two of those. So you'll get eight servings. Right. But if I were to divide this up into quadrants, I know it's not the prettiest thing. No? That is your serving. Okay, that's probably as much as you'd want to eat. Yes, Now, absolutely. I mean, if you're raising teenage boys, guilty, you know, <laughs> they'll eat more. So obviously factor that in. But when you're looking at the bag, and we tell you that it's 60 servings, that is 60 servings of food, that's enough for one person to get around 1,800 calories a day and 40 grams of protein. Wow. So that's right. where the seven-day supply comes in. So if there's two people in your house, and you're like, well, at this point in time, I think I'm only gonna able to do one, so then you know that you'll have enough food for around three days, three plus a little bit. Sure. Now, the Red Cross and FEMA, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, they recommend kind of their baseline, what everybody should have in their home is three days of food per person. Mm -hmm. And until I worked with ReadyWise, there's no way I could have done that. I mean, that's a lot of food in your pantry. Yeah, that's If true. you think about the amount of food to get that many calories and then have it be nutritious. Right. And right. then have it taste good. Right. So yeah. I was definitely <laughs> failing on all the above. <laughs> so this makes it easy, right? Oh, you don't yeah. have to figure out how to assemble the cans. You don't have to figure out what's going to stay shelf stable. And I guarantee you there's nothing at the grocery store that's shelf stable or that you would want to eat for, for 20, 25, 25 years. Yeah. Yes. You didn't put a can on your shelf for 25 years later. You're like, really? 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 Am I going to eat that? No, you're not. And again, this is a great way to try it too. Yes. Because obviously we sell, ReadyWise does a great job of selling much bigger containers. We do tubs. You know, we have lots of different versions. For me, this is a great try me. It's great for camping. If you're on a budget and quite frankly, food, we know the cost of food nowadays. When it comes down to per serving and you divide it into the price of it tonight, that's a really, believe it or not, affordable way of eating. $1.50 a serving. It, I mean, that's amazing, it's guys. And I just, oh my gosh, I can't believe I went to the groceries today I bought two bags I think two bags it was $57 right. I was just like and I wasn't buying like bottles of uh, you know Vouv or you know really <laughs> expensive champagne right? right I was just buying stuff right yep. two bags only so you know that might be an issue for you and you're like well you know we got to eat or you just never know when emergency is going to happen we don't we don't know if it's going to be emergency that oh my god somebody lost their job and how you're going to eat you know how we're going to afford so I can get to a paycheck it might be the emergency of the hurricane it might be the storm coming up it might be the ice that hits. You do, oh, I'll tell you another thing. Oh my gosh, how handy would this have been to have a couple packs of this when they had that huge ice storm up in was it Virginia last year? Oh, absolutely. And people were trapped on that highway yep. for hours and hours and hours and hours. In hey, their car. They had snow. In their car. Guess what? Yeah, you could have made water out I'm of it. I'm you, you could have made water. Yep. And guess what? Now you've got food. And even if you just threw a couple, of, but again, you want to make sure you keep them cool and dry. So don't put it in a hot car forever. But you know, if you're but in, in, the winter, country, in the winter time, yeah, so I grew up up oh, north. Oh, that's great. Throw it in the car. Absolutely. And we used to keep like granola bars and bottles of water in the back yep. because you do occasionally have to worry about sliding into a snowbank. And that was just my dad's thing of, you know, well, at least you'll have something to eat. It was a granola bar. <laughs> you know, it wasn't going to do very much. So obviously, no matter the situation, if it's a fire risk, you are grab and go, which I great love. Point. If you are a hurricane and at least you get a couple of, you know, days warning to make plans, maybe you're making the plans to evacuate, but I I have four boys. If I show up at Suzanne's house because she's in a safe location, she doesn't want to feed me. <laughs> you know, she wants me to come with my own food. Or if people evacuate to you, no matter That's the situation, point. now you have food for them. This is about being prepared for anything. And none of us can really know what's ever going to happen, but you know you need to eat. And I know, especially raising teenage boys with the price of groceries, that if I can both be prepared, have food that tastes great, have peace of mind as a mom and get a good value all at the same right. time that is checking literally every single box there is for me now guys this is part of our weekly deal drop which means the deal is only good for a limited amount of time and we've got three flex and what i really love is free shipping on this too mm. this is again this is not a small little pack i mean it's a really good size pack here so to get free shipping on this is exceptional and rare so definitely take advantage of it and here's the other thing you buy it once i hope to god you never have to use it my dream is you'll never have that emergency I Absolutely. really do. 
too. That's, I hope you never have to open it up. But if you need it and when you need it, you're going to go, I am so happy I got that. And maybe you don't need it for 10 years or 15 years or 20 years, but 25 years from now, you don't have to worry about the one thing, two things that are most important in emergency, getting power, that's our today's special, yep. and getting food, and that's the ready wise. And I love the fact, Steph, that we have them both in the same show. So it's two orders, you get it done, use our flex pay, and then forget it, don't even worry about it. You're, you actually are prepared. I don't know if you've ever seen an emergency, man, people get so desperate because when oh, they're not scary. prepared, oh, it's the awful. The fear takes over. Yes. I mean, grocery store shelves being bare, I mean, heck, that Before doesn't even take yeah. an emergency. Oh my we God. got problems yeah. with that right now. I mean, well, you know, it's crazy. When we know a hurricane's coming here to Florida. Oh, it's crazy. It's cleared out. Everything's yeah. cleared out. Like, and if you were the last one to get to the store to get water, you're just in trouble. Yep. You so really this are. is how you keep yourself from panicking. Uh, mm -hmm. The way ReadyWise puts it is you are confident and comfortable because you're confident knowing that you have checked the box, your family will eat, it is one less thing to worry about, and you're comfortable throughout the emergency because you have food. There is nothing worse than being hungry. Listening to your kids be unhappy because they're hungry. Obviously, if you're breaking into this for your entire family, something's going on in the world, right? There's already something else you're worried about, being at rising water or approaching snow or whatever the natural disaster may be. This allows you to focus on those other things. Keep the kids calm, shore up the basement, uh, help the receding floodwaters, whatever it is, you've got the food covered. And remember, all it takes to have this food is water and it does not have to be hot water. So I'm gonna take what's in the pouch, and in this case, it is teriyaki rice. You can see that that is real rice. And what I like so much about that is that you can also see the peppers. You can also see the carrots. And this one, by the way, has a little bit of a kick. Because guess what? It's teriyaki. If we called awesome. this teriyaki rice and it was bland, you would immediately be like, I thought this was a recipe, <laughs> right? You expect it to have a little bit of a zing. And you can smell that, and the spices are there. And honestly... What are we eating tonight? Uh, we could eat whichever you I'll like. I'll try something other than what I had for dinner. Okay. <laughs> is that stroganoff? Uh, that is stroganoff. We'll go ahead and show you in five minutes. That will be very oh, good. edible and ready to go. But okay. yeah, let's try the stroganoff right okay. now. I see it we back there. We did warm these like, up oh, for you. What the heck? It's time to eat. Well, um, a couple things. One, we have auto ship on. On this. Oh, it is nice and warm. Oh, look at this, you guys. Now, come on, look at this. Look at that. Now, that is like homemade stroganoff. Can you guys see it? Homemade stroganoff. Look how delicious that is. Does that not make your mouth water? And you can see it's not mush. It's not, you know, porridge. <laughs> right. It's the texture it's, that really is cool about this. Yeah, think it's about pasta yeah. if the texture's off. It's oh, like paste. Oh, it's awful. It's yeah. so bad. So and I'm we, a texture girl. So if this was funky, I'd let you know. <laughs> okay, um, auto ship. You can get this every 30 days. So again, if maybe this has to be the way you've got to eat for a couple of months, that's an awesome thing to do. And you can slow that down, you can speed it up. Maybe you're going on a trip and you want really convenient food. Maybe you have someone going hiking or camping. This is fabulous camp food awesome. because it's so simple and easy and it is hearty. And you do have a ton of protein, which actually surprised us as well. So that's a, a great thing is auto ship. And I have about 700 spaces for auto ship. If you just want to get it one time, that's what most people do, quite frankly, and then you're done. You check it off the list and you go, oh my gosh, that's one less thing I have to worry about. And it really is, and we've had prepared food from HSN for a long time at our mm -hmm. house. And um, it's awesome that I don't even think about that. Right. You know what I mean? Yep. Like once I got mine, I'm like done. Right. Like I don't even, if a hurricane's coming, we'll think about tying up the furniture and getting stuff inside, but I don't have to worry about food anymore. Right, and the same thing whether it's snow or flood waters or oh, anything else. Good. Yeah, I love the stroganoff oh, too. Oh, really good. Yeah. <laughs> so here is a look at everything that is coming to you in the dry bag. By the way, the only requirement with this is that you store it in a cool, dry place. A couple of great ideas because I'm kind of attached to the dry bag. Good. Like, because there's a lot of things I need to keep dry. The one time that we did have a little scare here on the last few years, I was taking things off the wall. I was, you know, just all of a sudden you assume the worst. You could put this in you know, a plastic container under your bed for storage, and then you have a dry bag at the ready. Exactly. So you could buy a dry bag for $30, $40 by itself. You're getting that kind of as the bonus with all of the food. Fun little test we did too, we put water in the dry bag, that is also a water bag. Because remember, if it'll keep water oh. out, it will keep water in. So if you need it to haul water or That's store great water, you can do that as well. Yeah, we found that on the ReadyWise website. So really great idea of other things you can do with the bag. So do you mind, let's take a minute and go sure. through every entree yes, that we're getting. Absolutely. Just so everybody can get an idea of the variety. Because honestly, it's pretty good. So there's two different grains, if you will. Uh, yes, you could use them for breakfast. You could use them for snacks. One of them being maple and brown sugar. So you're actually going to get 
get three packs of the maple and brown sugar cereal. When I tell you the cinnamon and the maple flavors just overwhelm you the scent as it as it cooks cook being a, a word that really just means rehydrate it tastes awesome and you will love the flavors then there's five different lunch and dinner style entrees and we're going to go right down the line here this is the teriyaki rice great chunks of carrots and peppers and if you were to put this in one of those white cardboard containers from like chinese takeout you'd never know that they didn't make it there and that it wasn't authentic that is how good the spicing is now suzanne and her husband uh, tried the uh, chicken pot pie with the potatoes. By the way, both the teriyaki rice and the chicken pot pie are gluten-free. And I think that is great because a lot of times there's people following certain uh, diets and guidelines within their families, mm -hmm. but that doesn't stop during an emergency. Mm -hmm. You know, no. that would really upset your stomach if you all of a sudden went on a different diet. So I like the fact that there's a couple gluten-free options as well, and there's also a vegetarian and a vegan option. Uh, we also have the creamy pasta with vegetables. That is one of my favorites. Uh, again, the rotini just keeps its shape and its texture. You can see the big chunks of peas and peppers and carrots, just a really nice flavor profile file there. Uh, the kids are big fans of the Cheesy Mac, but when we talk about variety, again, I like the fact that there's something with a little tang. I like a little more flavor than probably a small child will. It's not usually too hard to convince kids to eat Cheesy Mac. So that is very true. That is part of that. And of course, we uh, mom is happy when the kids are happy, emergency or not. Uh, Suzanne <laughs> also just tried the stroganoff. Uh, if you ate a blind taste test, closed your eyes, you would not know that I hadn't spent 10 minutes making a white sauce with a sour cream base and, and putting it into fresh egg noodles. That is how well blended and seasoned these entrees are. So you were getting two bags of each of these entrees, which is eight servings of each of these entrees. And then we also gave in a bag of granola, Great for snacking, great. great for anything. Uh, we're gonna talk in a minute about some fruits and vegetables you can add to it. But if you did nothing else, you are getting breakfast, lunch, and dinner for one person for seven days, and that figures about 1,800 calories a day and 40 grams of protein. So that's a lot of food for a week. It is a lot. And that's important food. Well, and again, you know, I think a lot of us, um, <clears throat> it always happens, you end up being defense instead of on the offense. Mm -hmm. So what happens is if you're on offense, you're prepared, you're ready, you have it, you're ready to go. If you're defensive, what happens is once the emergency happens, then you're freaking out trying to figure it out. I like being on the offense. I'm not a big fan of being on the defensive position. Um, I don't think any of us really want to be that. And a lot of us think, oh, that'll never happen to me. I am telling you, you, you absolutely know someone who's had an emergency where they needed food and they need water and they need electricity. We know that. And by the way, if you need water, we've got this awesome, awesome uh, water bottle, which is fabulous from, again, ReadyWise. Love this. Yeah. This is available. It's going to filter all your water for you. Literally drinking out a pool of a puddle. This is going to take care of it for you. So we've got the water. This is going to be your food element. And then our today's special, we'll show that one more time maybe on the side graphs. That's also available for your electricity. So instead of going in through life just going, well, it's never going to happen to me, you just don't know. For example, the poor folks in Kentucky. Yes. Who would think they'd have all that flooding in Kentucky? Kentucky. Right. Yep. I mean, think about all the crazy weather we're having. No one is safe, unfortunately, and that stinks. I mean, you know, if you think about out west, you guys have a lot of uh, tornadoes. We deal with hurricanes all the time in Louisiana, here in Florida. Houston Tech, all the Texans yep. have to deal with that. Guys, in the wintertime, how often have you had powder outages? Or the ice or snowstorm has taken down big electronic, you know, like those big, uh, you know, poles, you know, your electronic lines going house to house. And again, without electricity, your fridge eventually is going to obviously not work. The food's going to go bad inside the fridge. It just becomes this desperate game of almost survival. When you have all this, all of a sudden you really do have a sense of calm and a sense of security knowing, well, in this case, at least I've got my food handled. And pretty much I'm going to be able to find the water, hopefully, to be able to cook it. But remember, any water will work. It can be cold. It can be tap water. It can be, you know, filtered water, which I would recommend. Absolutely. Picking up that bottle is awesome. It's meant for drinking, but you can squeeze out of the bottle. Oh, so listen, if you were really worried about the quality of your water, you can squeeze through the bottle, take the water, use it to rehydrate the food, and you literally are good That's to go. Smart. You've checked absolutely every box. Because I have a bottle box. that has a filter in it. Mm -hmm. You can't squeeze it out. You can uh, only suck it out. Yes. So it's and awesome. that makes it awkward. <laughs> yeah, well, and, yeah, you can spit <laughs> okay. it out in your fridge. Right, yeah. Now we're but getting I mean, gross. That's <laughs> really smart. I yes. mean, that's what ReadyWise really thinks of all these little details to make this 
really be an effortless purchase for you. Uh, I want to point out too, we've got FlexPay on this, which is great. Mm -hmm. So here we go. To get this home, let me show you. We have three FlexPays of about $30. So you're going to pay it off in three months. You'll get it right away. Here's what you can do. Taste some of it. If you don't love it, you can send it back. We're still going to refund your money, but you don't have to pay it off until three months from now. And then you sit back and guess what? For the next 25 years, it, you don't have to worry. That's it. It's, it's awesome. A, it's really remarkable. You almost have to get your head around that. Right. If I make this investment, I don't have to worry. No matter what happens, wherever yes. my family goes, easy to move with you for 20 five years. There's nothing we can control in this world. We have so learned that in the past couple of years. And you truly need to be ready for anything. But no matter what's happening out there, no matter, maybe you're just having a day where you don't feel well. For me, it's a late night at work combined with bad traffic. Let's get something out for dinner. If you get ill, if you fall ill and aren't able to get to the grocery store or able to get up and make meals for your family, this is a great way to still put great tasting, nutritious food on the table. So I think we can define emergency loosely, right? We always talk about the natural disaster especially today with the generator. And listen, those are important and very unpredictable. But an emergency can be anything that is just keeping you from doing your normal routine and feeding your family. Sure. I got to the teriyaki okay, rice. It. It's warm, so definitely it. let it uh, cool right. off for just a second. But I want to hear about the, the zing and see if you notice what I I've noticed. I've not tried it yet. Okay, good. I'm glad that's a new one. Oh, it's really good. Isn't that fun? Oh, gosh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like great takeout from a Chinese exactly, restaurant. Exactly. It's just like the rice you get at a Chinese restaurant. That's really good. So what I like about this is when we say it's teriyaki rice or when we say it's creamy pastas and vegetable, that's really what it is. It isn't like just a, a hint of it or a powdered flavor of it, you know? When you say emergency food, I know the first thing that comes to mind is chalky, powdery, sticky, bland, and that is not what ReadyWise is all about. They have chef-designed recipes, and as you can see from each one of these dishes, when it says it's gonna be cheesy macaroni, you're gonna taste the depth of the cheese, you're gonna get the right consistency of the macaroni, and it's going to be the type of thing that you look forward to eating. So. Everything that we're making here, we're just adding water. You do see pots in front of me, but that's just because it reconstitutes or rehydrates more quickly with warm water. And quite honestly, both Suzanne and I will tell you, we'd really rather have a warm meal, but in an emergency, I'm eating a room temperature meal all day long, as long as it tastes good. And that's the difference with ReadyWise. I have some additional items that you can add to it if you'd like to, and I'm just gonna run the list really fast. You can add corn, broccoli, and peas. Those are all freeze-dried. We've got got um, dried fruits. We have banana strawberries. We have extra crunchy granola if you'd like to. We even have an instant coffee floating around here somewhere. I think it's still available. Yeah, it's Colombian um, and so good. Is it really? Oh my gosh. And so then good. we have the filtered water bottle. Remember guys, I think that is a huge element to add. All of these are going to have flex pay with them. Many of them have auto ship. So a lot of people we know love just the freeze dried um, bananas and the strawberries. Absolutely. Well, yeah. think about the produce prices. I mean, when you do a little math Great here, point. being able to get quality produce that's going to be shelved stable it's not going to turn brown it's not going to rot you're not going to be disappointed in the flavor you don't have to dehydrate it <laughs> yeah you don't have to do it yourself because right. yes that's a process you know and it's ready to go and i do often buy freeze-dried fruit just for snacking and back to school it's really expensive in the big box store so that's this a is a point. really great way to get it and a must-have if you camp if you hike if you hunt if you yeah. fish and want to take that kind of thing out but especially as a mom with kids where fruit is their thing like this needs to be in my emergency uh kit for sure because if we go more than about two days i'm gonna have some very sad kids <laughs> and sad people <laughs> anyway so you can have all this to sort of boost what you're already getting yes. or you can buy it separately we do have some of this on auto ship as well so we'd like to keep it coming also i do want to explain auto ship on our regular package that guaranteed you get tonight's price which is awesome because after this goes up it's a weekly deal drop it ends on sunday night uh we just dropped the deal i guess this mo uh, this morning i guess we did it today when these are sold out and i think we've sold maybe eight 900 right now um, then the next time you see it after the deal's over it's going to be 124.95 if you want to keep getting this and again you could slow the you could slow it down so let's say you're going to buy this and you're getting ready to go camping and mm -hmm. like this is a great camping food or boy scouts girl scouts whatever you might be going camping trip so everybody eats it up and then you can say hey you know what i want my next one to come 30 days or it might be 190 days you can get on auto ship and what's good about auto ship is you lock in tonight's price for as long as you stay in auto ship so that's a benefit you you don't have to worry about the price going up on you now we all know the price of food is going up on all of us 
feels like every second right now. <laughs> but in this case, we will not raise the price on you if you get into the auto ship program. So it's according to what is your emergency. And I love what you said. It could be no emergency. It just be could having fun, want to do something really quick and easy. Mm -hmm. Maybe you've got a kid who's off to college and they're not eating right. And you're like, you know what? I'm just going to send it directly to them. At least they'll eat a little better. I remember you talked about that. I did with that. Your my son. son Ethan. Yes, uh -huh. absolutely. And I just sent my son to college. He was eating terrible. I have he no idea eating, what mine's he eating. He was eating uh, ramen noodles. Oh, well, like we, yeah. every single day. So I just sent it to him and I said, it's a guy. And there's no protein in those, by the way. So no, no major it's awful. improvement. Uh, major improvement. <laughs> yeah. So I did. I literally sent him and said, just heat water up and throw it in, and you got this. And it was so much better than eating ramen noodles. Right. So that's awful. the thing. And you know, maybe it's your parents that aren't eating well, or maybe yeah. it's your parents that you don't want going out once the weather gets bad, when it rains too much, when the roads get icy. You know, wherever we are in the country, there's something we all have to worry about. That's just the nature of life. It's true. But we also all have to eat. So I just to like take the stress out of one thing in our lives and know that the people we love have food that tastes great and is good for them. So I want to put together the cheesy macaroni, but while I do that, Take a Ooh, little how we doing sniff on this? or stir up and just, doesn't it just Ooh. smell like a hug? You can smell the creamy cheesiness of that sauce. Look this, awesome that, that is, is the creamy color. pasta rotini uh, with the vegetables. Wow. That is actually one of my favorites. That looks it great. is just luscious. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know how that one got so amazing, but that is always mine. So I wanted <laughs> you to get a little scent of that too while I start the macaroni. Remember, you are never going to add anything but water to this. So the funny thing is when I first gave the mac and cheese to my kids, they were like, oh, Oh, you didn't do it out of the box because I admit I do occasionally make mac and cheese out of the box but even then you got to add butter and milk and yeah. listen your fridge goes out you don't have butter and milk and suddenly I'm not making box macaroni and my son's like oh I guess it's so much better when you make it the that sauce and do it from scratch and I just sat there and didn't say anything and you know that's the flavor here though it doesn't taste like the one from the box it tastes like the one that you made yourself and we call that what do we call that we call that holiday macaroni in my house because <laughs> it's the only time of year you I make get mac from holidays. scratch <laughs> yeah, sorry, probably shouldn't admit that, but you know, working mom, you do what you gotta do. But the taste is there. I mean, if you think this is my holiday macaroni, I'm thrilled, right? It's, right. The, it's the fact that it is what you expect the food to taste like that ReadyWise is so proud of. Um, when we were talking about food costs, you can go to the ReadyWise website right this second, and it's $124.95. Mm. I did check right before we went one. on there. Yep, so quite honestly, that's not a bad price by any means, and oh, by the way, they've been so sold out most of this year at that price. And the reason is, you can figure, yep. people are worried about their food dollars. People are worried about yes, inflation. This is a U.S. company. They are based in Utah. People know them. They've been around since 2009. And quite honestly, anybody that has ever been through any type of storm or emergency situation knows now you need to have some of this around. Mm -hmm. So honestly, they've well, had so a banner couple of years, but yet they'll give us a good deal so you can prepare. But think about this. Think about just COVID in general. People weren't going to the stores. Right. They weren't going out. How were you getting your food? I mean, people would go out for you. We had some neighbors who said, would call each other and say, hey, do you need anything? I'm going to do I'll go. But there yes. were a lot of people who were absolutely frozen and just so afraid. And I totally understand. Absolutely. Why they wouldn't want to go out of their house. That is an example of one of the weirdest emergencies you can ever have. I mean, come on. That was just an, a, an anomaly. Like, but, get, but who knew that was going to happen? Right. So guess what? Those of you who had this already in your house, you weren't worried. You're like, well, okay, we didn't know what was going to happen. We didn't know how long things are going to be closed down. But the people who were prepared, guess what? They weren't as worried as your neighbor. They weren't as worried as somebody down the street. So I think it's so absolutely vital that you are prepared because we just don't know what crazy stuff's going to happen. You don't know if it's going to be those bad storms that poor Kentucky's going through with all that flooding. You don't know if it's going to be some crazy forest fire and you have to leave your house. What are you going to do? You got the car, the kids, the family. You grab this and you leave the house because you've got to run yep. because the fires in California are about to engulf your home. I mean, there's just so many crazy things going on nowadays that if you're not prepared, you're not prepared. And there's nothing worse than being in a really bad circumstance and then it's even worse or it's right. exaggerated simply because you don't have food and you don't have power. Guys, we've solved both the issues tonight. I don't know, Kevin, if you pop the today's special up there again, but this is a really brilliant way to get a long-term energy solution with our today's special. We'll kind of put it right there and then get your food here from ReadyWise. And guess what? You're done. You literally don't have to worry about it ever again. You go, you know what? I hope I never, and I hope you do. I hope you never have to open this up, although I would just 
out of curiosity, but I hope you don't ever have an emergency where you have to use either that generator or this, but daggone it, when you need it, you're gonna be so thrilled you have it. Like you're gonna go, oh my gosh, great investment because we can buy jeans we can buy jewelry we can buy a whole bunch of stuff in an emergency we don't we could care less about that stuff you will leave All it behind sudden, oh my gosh you yep. will you're like nope we don't care but you know you got to eat and you know you have to have power and we've got those covered tonight and i would if you can swing it grab the water bottle to go with it because now you've got water i mean out of a puddle you literally if you're that desert or a swimming pool and i've actually thought about that we had those big hurricanes come this way a couple years ago absolutely and through my checklist in my head i said can we use the water in the pool to be able to drink and I knew I had the ability to do it. Yep. 99.9% Nine of everything gets filtered by that filter. That's so huge. it does solve a ton of problems. Now of course we still recommend that you have water to store but again if I'm running and bailing with my family, I'm gonna grab the food and I'm and gonna grab, grab that, that bottle. I'm not gonna be carrying gallons. Yes. So it solves a That's lot of different problems because here's the thing, you don't know what the problem's gonna be. You don't know exactly the situation well, you'll be like in. it's not like it's scheduled. Right, you know, like, which isn't hey, good for me, by the way. I really prefer things yeah, I scheduled. I prefer my emergency. <laughs> Let me know when it's gonna happen. But that's the thing, you know, you can never predict when it's gonna happen. Hurricanes are the craziest thing. We, we're, we're, we have, Floridians know to be prepared. We, in North Carolina, you guys know too, because you get whacked this way and this way. And those of you in Louisiana, you know that. Those of you out in Texas and Houston and that whole coast area, we all know to be ready. You know, if you don't, shame on you, but you're in a good spot tonight. But then it's all those other places you just don't think, oh, it's never gonna happen to me. And I'll be darned, seriously, how many people do you know in your life who could tell you a story about emergency they were in where they had a problem? Oh, probably no power, everybody. No food. everybody. Everybody. I mean, I've lived in five different states and every state had its own situations. Issues, yeah. You know, when yeah. you grow up up north, you know that ice storms happen, yeah. you know that blizzards happen, and you won't be getting to the store. And if you get to the store, the trucks probably don't get to the Great store. Point. And you deal with bare shelves. So no matter where you are, no matter what could happen, we are all going to eat. So I love the fact that for $1.50 a serving, you can get food that tastes great, all it needs is water, lukewarm tap water, ice cold in the depth of winter, and you will still have food that reconstitutes, rehydrates just with water, because essentially what Wise is doing is they're making the awesome, you know, casserole or meal, if you will, and then they're taking the water out of it. All right. you're doing is putting the water back in. They already did the hard work. They already did the seasoning, the textures, all of that. That's the science behind it all. But the really cool science is they're putting in a, what I like to call a smart pouch because it's got to have some really cool technology in it, way above my engineering, not mine, <laughs> that has this shelf stable for up to 25 years, which is why we're saying, you know, you do this once and you're done. You can put this in a cool, dry place, check the box and know that for 25 years, my family will eat no matter what happens. Now, I'm a big believer in the, just so you know we're not crazy when we tell you it tastes good, open it up and try one, right? Pick one that sounds good to your family. I do love the tricking your husband part. I also recommend tricking your family because they'll never know. Right. They'll never know it's emergency food and they'll be shocked because nobody thinks those two words mean taste good. And right? there's actually protein in this too. I think yes. that's so important to understand. It's it's not like it's just a whole bunch of stuff that's sort of filler. There's real stuff, real food, real vegetables, real pasta. It's pretty darn amazing when you really think about it. And it's delicious. That's what's really surprising is truly how good it is. And my husband was in the Army for years. And when he said, oh, my gosh, this is so much better than MREs, he said, oh, he can, those are the worst. And those guys had to gag those down. I can't he imagine. Said, he goes, gosh. And he said, you know what? He was really funny. He said, you know, if you're in an emergency, this really hits the spot. You know, if you can't cook up a beautiful beautiful gourmet meal, he's like, this is really good. Like, he was really pleasantly surprised tonight when he tried it. I feel like there's a comfort factor with this. I'll mm -hmm. let this one cool for just a second. That is the pasta with vegetables. Mm -hmm. But there's a comfort factor. It's, it tastes great. It lets you know that you're being oh. nourished, that you're gonna be okay. That's my favorite. Oh, now I know why. That's yeah, really good. Yeah, isn't that good? So you're not look, gonna be disappointed there's a real in the carrot. flavor. I just ate a real pea. I could tell it was a pea and it wasn't <laughs> mush. It was really amazing. All right, we gotta wrap it up. Steffi, thank you for hanging out with us. Thank of you course. to Ready Wise too for always doing a nice job. This is a weekly deal drop, guys. We got seven others, I think, seven or eight others that are on hsn.com. They literally are good for a single week or if they sell out early. 
And that could happen with our ReadyWise, so you might want to think about ordering this now. Also, AutoShip, I've got about 600 AutoShip left, so that opportunity is getting rather limited. All right, it's almost midnight. What happens at midnight? That means we have a new Today special. Yes, we do. See, she's been here for a while. I have, and, and I have my eye on it. Oh, girl, it's really good. Is it? Okay, yeah, good. Yeah, it's got Cool Max. If you shvet at night, if you got the little oh. hot stuff going on, we got that covered, too. <laughs> Plus, we're going to revive your mattress. Stay with me. <laughs> HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. And I'm Suzanne Runyon, by the way. We're live. You might not know that. Can we go to a big old wide shot? Because I'm plopping down. Uh, it's the best time of the day right here <laughs> when I get to lay down and do my job. Why am I so comfortable? Because we're going to transform your mattress. Do not buy a new mattress before you watch what's going to happen in, what, 20 seconds? Because we're going to transform that map mattress for you. Here's what's very interesting. If you've got an old mattress, if you've got a new mattress, if you've got a mattress that's too firm and you're like, gosh, I wish it felt better, we've got to solution and it's an awesome way to be able to transform your sleeping experience by adding one of our ever ever popular toppers and here's the scoop on our new today special 